Hello everyone, welcome back to another Minecraft video. I Knight here, and yeah, it's not Hypixel this time. Uh, I got some news about uh, Hypixel. Well, not actually Hypixel. Uh, it's more driven. His PC died, so he has to get a new PC. I don't know when it's gonna be done, but he'll be back soon enough. So more Bitwars games will be coming. Whoa! Lucky me. More Bitwars games will be coming uh, eventually. Maybe solo, uh, but Driven will be back. That's for sure. So I decided to come. She doesn't like me. She doesn't like me. Sad. Uh, so I decided to continue our uh, Stardew Valley uh, series. No, uh, actually, Farm Valley. I get my ass kicked over here because I've been playing this solo as well, and the enemies are so damn hard. Where did I leave my dead? There we go. Okay, it's been a while uh, since I've been here on this on this world, so I need to. Harvest uh, goddess. Do we have the blue? We don't have the blueprint. Okay, so let's get the blueprint. Let's more sugar That's some extra money. Okay, let's summon the harvest goddess. I have to grab the wood. No, I don't. Let's get the wood first. Dozen uh, of wood to get the to get the blueprint. I'm gonna redo my inventory real quick. I want my, to have my food over here and my drink. There we go. I'm gonna remove the remove the dead point. I don't know, if you guys want me to, to leave the dead points uh, on the map, just let me know in the comments. For me it's kinda uh, irritating because if I die a lot of times, uh, what will probably happen, it's gonna be not easy to see where you're going because it's, the whole freaking world will be one bookmark. Okay, we're back up. And let's get some wood. Oh, awesome, we are next to a dark oak forest. We are gonna get that wood in no time. Let's get this. What's in here? Oh, we already... We already need only one more wood block? 
Really? Okay, I'm just gonna take one wood block and I'm gonna get uh, get going. There we go. Awesome. I'm gonna put this up in there. I'm gonna put some things away that I don't really need at the moment. Now let's go to the harvest goddess. Ow. So, if you guys remember, to summon the harvest goddess, you need two pools of water, two vanilla flowers on the outside of it, a flower pot in the middle with a vanilla flower in it, and right click it with, uh, with a stick to get this flower. And if you get the goddess flower, you just simply throw it into the pond, and poof, there she is. Oh hello again, if you've forgotten we're looking to bring our first villagers to town. I just need two dozen locks to help you to help you get started. Okay, no problem. Here are the locks. Don't tell me you need She needs twelve of the same kind. Uh no problem. Oh two dozen, that's twenty four. Whoops. Yep, counting with Liam. Not really good idea. So let's get 12 more of these. There we go. I love how the, the leaves disappear like that. Very easy. We sure do have our uh, two dozen. Wait, there's even more up there. Is there more? Hello? Apple. Thank you for the apple. I'm gonna look up there. Let's see if, uh, if there's something. Uh, oh my god, can jump. Okay, let's see. Are there any more wood blocks in there? Because normally they discard all when all the wood blocks are uh, destroyed, but it seems like this one doesn't want to. Oh wait, here it is. There we go. Now it should all despair. There we go. Let's go back down. Let's take this oak, oak wood as well. So we have 24 of the same uh, wood type. It's gonna be way easier to do. Whoa, large spike. That might happen when uh, when Liz wants to di uh, disband all together. It can get a little bit laggy. Twenty-four. There we go. Let's turn this into wood planks and let's make another chest. I'm gonna explain the, the bird's nest uh, in a second. I'm gonna get uh, ourselves the blueprint first. But I prefer to get it without dying. Oh yeah, after a while the goddess uh, will despawn, uh, but she will leave a goddess flower behind for you. So just throw it back in and here she is again. Right click her with the 24 uh, locks. Perfect, just what we need, thanks a bunch. I've got the perfect thing for you right here. This is a structure blueprint, you use them to select the area you want, to, uh, want the building to be built. You'll see a ghost image of the building when you have it selected. Once you've found the spot, simply right click. If Yulif hasn't moved in yet, he'll appear and get started working on the building right away. You'll just have to wait a little while for him to be done. Take note that take note you can queue a bloop uh blo bleh. Okay, I got a little distracted. Take note you can 
queue up blueprints, but only one can be built at a time. Oh, and don't worry if he dies from from some tragic accident, like me killing him last like last time. He should respawn when. <laughs> Whoops. So actually, what happens is uh, if you if you kill Yulif or Yulif dies by fall damage or something else. Uh, he will respawn after uh, some time, or when you uh, re-log onto your world, he will be back. Okay, fun fun thing with Yulif. Uh, Yulif is actually the carpenter of this uh, of this town. I'm gonna place him somewhere over here, I think. Should I play? Hmm. I like to bring this this island down, actually. <coughs> Yeah, I think I'm gonna bring it down uh, off screen. Oh yeah, that's what happens when you have road. Uh, Yulif is actually our builder. He will build all kinds of uh, buildings that you choose. That you choose to uh, to build. You'll need some uh, items. That he has eye problems. Uh, you will need some items though to do that. The items and money will be uh, displayed on on the building uh, that he sells, and you need to build some uh, buildings to unlock new buildings later uh, in time. So let's actually make ourselves a shovel, grab some dirt. I want to fill in that hole over there, so I can actually build the house over there so let's get down here safely there we go so the hole was around here we go let's get let's get rid of this hole normally I'm not this laggy guys uh, I Normally I'm not this laggy, but for some reason I'm suffering about uh, with some lag. I hope to get it fixed in the future. This mod pack is actually pretty fun, but it can get a little bit laggy sometimes. Depends on the strength of your computer. There we go. That's so fun about leveling up your sword. You guys, uh, for the new guys that are watching, you can level up your sword and give them uh, custom abilities. I'm gonna show them in a second. This should actually be good for the house. Yeah, this is looking good. Okay, this is the carpenter's house. That's Yulif. So, what you do is shift, right click to confirm, and he will start building it. Like you can see, by just walking over it, he is building it. So in the meanwhile, I'm going to collect some flowers. Oh, the the fireworks are getting me laggy. I think I know why it's lagging. There are like too many, uh, too many items and grass around me. I think that's taking up my speed. There we go. Gonna take as many flowers as possible because you will need them to grind up your first uh, pair of money. Get a lot of money going. It's getting nighttime though. You can see uh, where spring trees uh, is displayed. Under it is the day and the the time of the day. So it's actually almost bedtime for us b before we get get our ass killed. Whoa. I think it's Yulif building that's lagging me out a little. So 
let's get away from it a sec for a second and go to bed. There we go. Okay, the, the, the goddess is gone. Let's see if she left a flower. If it didn't despawn yet. Nope, there it is. Pick that up. We need a drink though. I'm gonna drink some dirty water for the time being. It's just gonna give you thirst if you're, uh, if you're having bad luck, like this. It's not that bad, it's just uh, your water is gonna de uh, deplete faster during the period you have uh, thirst. But it's it's kind of the same as uh, as hunger. So actually not that dangerous. Let's get back up here. Store some of our items, like the flowers. There we go. I'm gonna show you the bird's nest now. While Yulev is building, bird nest time. So if you can get these if you uh, cut down a tree, the leaves tend to drop these. Just hold them in your hand and right click and you'll get some items. A feather, a gold nugget, a puppy and a stick. String, flint, okay, more string, this is good. Very good. There we go. Nice items. I can use most of them. You are food. Thank you. Oh yeah, the sword level. The more you fight with the sword, uh, you will gain level experience. And if you gain up a level, you will be able to purchase ability tokens well actually you gain abil ability tokens and you can uh, buy some nice handy abilities so I, I use uh, bloodlust the enemies will become withered so I'll become something like a withered skeleton only more human well, actually human huh. easier said than done I'm a skeleton More up, I use Chained. Enemies within a certain radius will be set on fire, so it's actually very handy. And I use Void. A small chance at dealing a large amount of damage. So it's actually very good, if I say so myself. So hopefully Yulov is done soon. He's actually building pretty fast, so I'm just gonna I know it's boring, but I'm gonna tear down the mountain. Oh wait, I know what I can do. I'm gonna get my armor first. Like I said, you you want to have some iron armor. I'm going to get my bucket, and this is actually a very interesting trick. Get a water bucket. Whoa, like. And go near some flowers and use the walker bu bucket to remove the flowers. See? A very handy truck. trick. I think it's lagging because of my OBS, actually, because I didn't have so much lag yesterday. Only the shuriken is not affected by it. so we can have more uh oh, more shuriking. there we go there's a lot of shuriken over there shuriken 
is handy to make some extra money but you will get better uh, crops eventually and we will be working to that very soon but step by step there we go, the building is done you want to bring Jade, that's Jade, the daughter of uh, Yolif. So, just right click her. And she, nice to meet you, I'm Jade. I'm kinda uh, looking for a flower, flower right now. So it's like the goddess said, she will be looking for a flower. So, right click her with the flower and... N okay, seems like she doesn't rec recognize this as a flower, so use this. Hey, looks like you have a flower for me. The goddess told me all about you. I can't wait to see the town grow. I think the goddess wants to thank you for helping us out. So you should see her. Should go see her. But afterwards, please do come back and visit me, as I have something I'd love to show you. So we will. So we will do that. Every building that has a shop in it will have some kind of sign uh, outside of it. Saying which days it is at work and from what time to what time. So now, Sunday to Friday from 9 to 17.30. So let's see what Yulif has. Looking for a new building? Let me help you. Click shop and this is all we can build if we have the money for it. So animal range, poultry farm, general store. That's, that's our next goal actually, general store. But our first first real goal is the shipment box. So 16 wood blocks. Let's just chop down the first and best tree. There we go. I'm gonna show you in a second why that why we need uh, the shipment box. Need to hurry up actually because he closed at 1730 and it's 13 uh, 13 hours almost Almost two o'clock. Uh, two o'clock. Yeah. There we go. I have enough wood. You leave. There we go. Shop and buy the shipment box. There we go. We have it in our inventory. I'm gonna take it with me. So the shipment box. The thing you do with it is you simply put it down. And you take something you can sell. Something like I don't know if we have actually. I actually I don't know if we have anything to sell. Oh yeah, I think we can sell food in it. No, not this. Yeah, bread. We can sell bread. You just right click, and the shipment box, uh, box will consume what you have uh, that you can sell. Like shuriken, you can sell as well. Well, we can do that actually. There we go. There we go. Climb back up. And just hold right click with the item you want to sell. If I find it back, there we go. Just hold right click and everything will be placed in the shipment box. Now, if you go asleep, you will gain the money. But first, I like to say hi to the goddess fl uh, to the goddess again. Let's get going. I should make a bridge actually. Throw this back in, and there she is. Well done, there. This town will be built in no time with you at the helm. Getting things done will probably cost you some money, though. So I'm happy to give you a starting gift of 1000 gold. I hope you spend it wisely. Anyway, you should be off to see Jade again now. Thanks for the help. Nice. There's also something I want to tell, uh, if you go to bed uh, any time of the day, your hunger will be restored back to full. 
it doesn't work with your uh, with your thirst sadly but hey the hunger is not at least something if you don't have food anyway so let's get back to Jade Explore the house actually. Because sometimes in the house there are some chests. You can get some nice stuff. It's all randomized by the way. Not, it's not always the same. If it's laggy, I will try to fix it eventually. I don't know why it is, but it simply is, so nothing I can do about it right now. Awesome, we have some we have some formula. Let's expand this a little. I will be working on the land uh, off screen and show you guys next time as well what I've done just to make it more interesting and not boring I hope it's not boring uh, anyway so tilt the land in a 3x3 tree tree area and place a sack of seeds in the middle and it will place all around so let's do that two more times one go then the other thing she said was we need to fill up our water buckets now the simple simple trick I like to do is put the hole water in it fill the watering can pick up water and close the hole again that's for lazy turds like me by the way the day is almost over so I need to fill it all just right click the crops 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 and you'll start watering them there you go. And now what we do is simply go to bed. There you go. Hunger f back to full and achievement ship ahoy and see we we made with only five four or five 
sugarcane and one bread we made 95 uh, pieces of gold so let's speed up this process by watering the crops and going back to sleep in the meantime I'm gonna check if the harvest goddess left a flower for us I really need to to learn myself not to jump from high places all the time. I'm gonna break my leg one day. There we go. Got the flower. We don't have to summon her right now because we don't really need her at the moment. But if you if you saw the harvest goddess had a little a grey heart with uh, with it, that's the friendship's heart. You can give people gifts to uh, make them your friends. I will be working on it uh, eventually, but not right now because we need to get some other things done like earning money, building up the town, making some nice land, you know, getting started. So let's get back to sleep and get back to watering. Oh wait, it's already done. <laughs> awesome. So if it's done, right click and you'll get the turnips. Go. Awesome. We got 27 hard, hardy turnips. So let's get back to Jade after I have drunk something because this is ridiculous. My thirst is almost empty. Ow. Let's see Jade. There are the houses and that's Yulef. Jade will probably be upstairs. There she is. Of course I have them. There we go. Right click with the turnips to complete the quest. Whoa, you have done a fantastic job growing those hardy turnips. I am tempted to take them for myself, but you can keep them. I don't want you to have wasted your time on me. I should probably tell you that you can sell whatever you grow for gold. You'll just ha need a shipping bin. If you want, if you want them, you can buy them directly from my brother's shop when he is open for business. To use them, all you have to do is right click with the item held in your hand and they should be ready to be shipped. In the morning you'll get the gold for everything you ship. If you don't want to ship everything by hand, just place a hopper next to the bin and it will happily insert profits. Go to whoever placed it. Just, just to let you know, just to let you know though, the term, turns you have you've been growing aren't really worth much you'll need to grow some others which you can get from me if you want to make more money I do I do have a small supply but I'm happy to trade for five flowers at, a, at any time that's why I've been picking those flowers guys if you have five flowers you get a sack of turnips from Jade and you can grow them that's the best way to grind up some money in the early stage before uh, before you have the general store I would just su suggest though that you talk to my brother and get the general store built as soon as possible the people there should be able to sell you much more ver variety than I could ever as at last reward take this sickle you'll need it to harvest some crops and it is pretty effective at destroying dead ones. There we go, we got six extra turnips and for some reason two sickles. And it all vanished. I think that's one of the bugs. Because this this mod is still in development, uh there might be some bugs in it, like that, vanishing uh things. But nonetheless it's actually still fun uh fun to play. So let's ship all those. There we go. 
Let's take five flowers out of the inventory. Wait, how many can I can I do? Another five. Another five. And another five. So I'm gonna s trade those uh, four stacks, four times five flowers with jade. And we're gonna plant those turnips. Ow. Me and my fall damage all the time. So just right click her with flowers and she will say thanks for the flowers here have a bag of seeds and she will give you turnip, turnip seeds so just repeat it with flowers there we go it seems that uh, it has to be vanilla flowers to do this not with um, my mystical the chest however uh, you might be thinking van I know it. Why don't you check the chest again after you sleep? Well, it's not like whenever you go to sleep that they will re restock the chest. No, it will. It actually stays in the condition you left them, and in my condition, it's empty. Just simply empty. So I will follow this. And as final thing before ending uh, things off will eat but I could actually just sleep I'm gonna sleep and see how much those 27 turnips are worth there we go how much do we get uh, n really not much <laughs> we're gonna be grinding a lot on those so next time we're we'll farming valley I will save up the turnips that I will grow during the time I will be uh, changing the drains and yeah I will make I'll probably make an extra chest uh, on what to sell and I will place it by next time you guys are back so next time on farming valley I will just do that and leave a like if you enjoyed uh, subscribe if you enjoyed and leave a comment uh, down below the video if you want to say something uh, comment on what I do here comment some su suggestions of uh, games that you want me to do as well like specific servers or other mini games that Minecraft has to offer or other games in general I will take a look at it though uh, the, the, my disc my and Driven's uh, Discord group will be down below in the description, so if you like to join, you can always join. And yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Later.